<laughs> Please welcome Robin, Jared and Artem. <laughs> Boys, thank you so much uh, for coming in. Are you loving it? Is it horrific? Robin? It's awesome. It's the best experience, like, ever. Ever. You've all got lovely, really, really lovely partners. Patsy seemed nervous, but you must also have been nervous on the first night. Did you want to go, listen, love, this is my first time. How did you cope with it all? You know what, it's all about nurturing her to make sure that she feels comfortable and happy with what she's doing. But I was just as nervous, but um, the day that I don't have nerves, it's time for me to be doing a different job, because this, the nerves are what keep me going. Yeah, you've been, you've danced all over the world, you've danced on Broadway. How did it feel to get the call? Imagine. I don't know if that's your ringtone. <laughs> but, um, and they say, well, you can strictly come dancing. Were you delighted? I was running around the house like a child at Christmas that got too many presents and didn't know what to do with them. But they told me I couldn't tell anybody, so I had to celebrate on my own. So I was just running around like a big kid. Uh, Jared, <laughs> yes. you're away from home, you're training in Manchester, you're with Correct. the gorgeous Tina. How are you finding the whole experience? And how did you enjoy dancing at the weekend? Um, you know, it's actually been a lot of fun being in Manchester because it's actually like a bigger London. It's more spacious. I don't feel like there's so many people around me all the time. But uh, okay. I haven't had a chance. To say about that. <laughs> no, go ahead. Yeah. No, but I haven't had a chance to really explore Manchester because we've been so busy working on our routine and everything. I mean, every day it's like 24/7. We're working together. Um, but we've been having a really good time together. We've been getting along really well, and uh, we're having a blast. Yeah. yeah. How did you find uh, the criticism? It was a little bit towards you when yeah. the judges said they wanted her to be pushed a bit more. Have you taken that on board? Do you agree with them? No, I definitely agree with them. It, it could have been a lot harder. Um, you know, I, I, I tried my best, and, you know, actually I feel like I could actually push her a lot more, and I think it was, um, you know, they, they had a valid point. So definitely this time around, I'm going to push her a lot harder. And I have been to the point where, you know, she was like, I don't understand. Like, but I'm like, I really want you to understand. So I've really worked with her. And I think uh, this time around, we actually have a stronger routine. Uh, Artem, you're from Russia. Then you lived in L.A. You're yeah. here in an yep. excellent hat. Um, <laughs> Thank hat you. to be mentioned. Um, uh, how are you finding the experience? Uh, I think it's the best experience I've ever had so far. It's, it's exciting. You're busy 24-7. You can't really do anything else besides work. Working out, training, and hopefully sleeping. Yes. Uh, it's been rough. But um, no, I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, right. And also, my favorite thing, my fact, is that you two are living together. Yeah. Robin and Artem, aren't you? You've got a yes, flat we, with yeah. no furniture in it. Like, I'm going to lend. Do you want this? Well, I'm so <laughs> sorry. Uh, I'm happy to. Please, we somebody all know give I like to pay for, I'm happy to sit on the floor. Um, do, <laughs> yeah, you need, do you What do you need? Well, our sofa arrived this morning, but because we were both training, we, neither of us were there to be able to let the guy in, so they've taken it back again. <laughs> so one day we're going to meet at the right time, and we may have a sofa this time next week. Okay, yeah. good. Fingers crossed. Well, we can borrow this. It's nice. Yeah, take yeah, it. Take the middle nice. section. Maybe just one part of it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's look ahead. How is it? I because I think your training with Patsy looks brilliant, and also she suddenly seems to be like, okay, you know what? I'm going for it. Show me what to do. She's a completely different person this week. She's come out with this attitude of, I don't care what everybody thinks. I'm just going to go out and have a great time. And the, our rehearsals all this week, or as minimal as they've been, she's been on fire. Really? Yeah, absolutely so, crazy and loving it, yeah. Jared, how much do you and Tina worry about the competition? Was it quite weird to see everybody else dance and go, ooh, right, I see, or are you not even thinking about it? I don't even think about it, but for her, she worries about it so much. And I'm like, look, you really can't pay attention to anyone else but yourself because you're going to psych yourself out and then you're going to worry to the point where you're not going to do a good job. Yeah. And the thing is, I really want her just to focus on her so that way she doesn't worry about anything else. Okay, finally, Artem, I want you yeah. to promise me that you are going to wear a similar outfit every week. I mean that <laughs> genuinely. That was a hooded... Open, sort of, I want to say yeah. faux suede. Your hood is up. <laughs> Artem, that is a gift. That is a gift. Do you realize that that was magnificent? Um, I don't know. I hope so. I mean, that's what strictly people are going for. Just try to make it look good. So, yeah. um, I can't promise I, I will wear this every week. Clearly, I can't wear for Foxtrot that outfit because it would be just yes. a bit out of the proportions. But I guess, yeah, whenever there is a chance. I'm sure it's going to be something like that. So all we want to hear. Literally all we want to hear. <laughs> boys, thank Hands you so down, much. I will. Let's hear it for the new boys. Thank you. Now, we've seen our fox trotting couples, but for the remaining pairs, this week, it's the salsa. First up, to get hot and spicy. It's Patsy, Pamela and Anne. <laughs>